Hello everybody, it's I'm Biggie here, I'm back, and let's play more Unlimited Saga. Last time we met, we were at this Tetra Force. But here, why can't we use it? It's because I've been farming. I've been farming quite a lot. Farming so much that my characters have really high level panels now, check that out. Uh, after a while, um, each subsequent use of the Tetra Force requires your LP to be lower and lower. Um, it restores your LP, of course, but... Um, all my character levels are way too high. Well, I say character levels, but you know what I mean. My characters are way too strong now to actually take any LP damage. Also, um, Sapphire and Iskandar nearly mastered their level 4 tablets. So that's pretty cool. You see, like, cool spells like Ice Needle and Trickle here. But here we go. I can even cast Purify outside. Yeah, the purify spell when you use outside of battle fully heals a character, which is quite useful. But um, otherwise, if your character, you know, if all of your characters have no HP, it's better off just sitting around and healing, like uh, like we used to. Okay. Oh, let me just check on uh, my turn. Whoa, yeah, 2100 turns and about 12 magic tablets later. All of them level ones, which leads me to think that farming here for magic tablets aren't, aren't a very good idea after all. Oh, well, that needs more testing. But right now, some good testing. Ah, awesome. Yeah, let's just continue. Uh, if we head up towards the right here, inside here, there's technically a the meteorite I am not there, but I already picked it up. Uh, while exploring, but here we go. There's another boss battle. Same deal as before. The fiend protecting the chamber of planets. Here we go. And then it's loading. In darkness, I don't know what to sing about. But I'm knowing it anyway. And it's time to start the battle. So why won't you load, you stupid piece of... Okay. Anyways, our battles are going to be a lot different now, since, ev since, since everybody has an obligation to cast magic. Um, Roy is going to cast Recycle here, because he has a broken item that, uh, oh dear, the Grace is supposed to have. So yes, I'm going to have Roy actually start first, and cast Recycle on a broken black armlet. And um, Iskandar is going to cast Ice Needle, because he's awesome like that. Um, some supersonic and corona, and a boulder by uh, good friend Hero here. So we just slow down the turn, so we're just gonna take a few hits first, and then um, I'm going to have Roy just cast recycle by himself. Uh, why is this? Because I've been saving up a, a four-hit combo. Of and <laughs> oh dear, okay, I've messed up already. My four hit combo that I've been saving up is Boulder, Ice Needle, Supersonic, and Corona. So I'm supposed to have Hero cast it first. Yeah, if um. Whoa! Pretty good damage regardless. Look at that. Two LP damage right off the bat. Yep, combo sorting is actually quite useful when you're farming or doing whatever that requires you to cast a lot of magic. You're not obligated to land on the panels, so it's a lot easier to basically make a consistent combo if you're just casting magic. I'm just gonna have um, Grace cast a Rainbringer first to slow down at the turn and have her, let her have her go at the quest. No, at the battle. Okay, and slow down the turn. Take a couple of hits and four hit combo. Will she trigger anything? Nope, unfortunately not. Will this be enough to kill it? Let's just see. As you can see here, platinum swords aren't made for damage really. They're more kind of a um, deflective and instant kill thing. But yeah, there we go. So much. And here is Iskandar. <coughs> Gonna cast Purify on himself. 
Yeah, you can see that he has also learned Thunderbreaker thanks to his uh, level 4 water tablet. That's one of the other tablets that has uh, Thunderbreaker in it. And I've already messed up. My timing is pretty bad on this one. <laughs> I haven't been timing panels at all. All I've been doing lately is the um, magic. So. I've also messed up there. Oh, one LB ten. Basically, I do can't do anything now. Uh, I've, I've been. Look at this. Yeah, awesome. This is gonna kill it definitely. Should we reveal still to purify? It's gonna do awesome damage. Yeah, check that out. Five LP damage in one go. And a carnelian, which is pretty cool. Yep, if you learn Supersonic there, we mastered our water tablet. Um, these two have a way to go yet, but and over here we have a we've learned the meditation and Sapphire would have mastered her fire tablet, which is pretty cool, special, super special, awesome. <coughs> yep, we stepped on the oh, we didn't step on it. Well, we touched the constellation map thing, and here we go again down to the underground. Just heal ourselves up a bit. Anybody? Here we go. Uh, just heal ourselves up a bit and just descended downstairs. In the same type of area. Well, it's exactly the same area. They just placed uh, um, crystals from uh, top, uh, from bottom to top rather than from left to right. Or is it left to right to left instead of to bottom to top? Oh. Well, depends on your perspective, I guess. Anyways, it's the same as before. Just oh, treasure chest. It's the same as before. Just walk around, and uh, aha, I've forgotten. I was supposed to hand this back to good old Grace. And swap around, swap around. Um, oh, wait a minute. Um, I have a good chance to uh, do some. Quick fixing, quick fixing doesn't use up turns. Awesome. And so put that gauntlet. Awesome. Times two. Okay, now she could use water spells. And next staff. Cool. Okay, same as before. As long as you walk on the line of the constellation and fill, keep filling it up without leaving the area, you will. Oh, you will uh, unlock the exit of this area. Okay, sharp eye. Uh, let's see. Fortune telling. Should I? I'm considering if I should farm a bit further. Yeah, because um. Needle traps are actually a really cool way of losing LP. If your HP is at zero, you can just keep triggering it until you um, get to the wanted uh, LP. Oh. Haha! Sephiroth has just mastered her fire tablet just now, which is pretty cool. I just have got her for learn her si uh, level 4 rattle tablet and whoa! 57 fire! That's even with, even with her um, bonuses incomplete. Ooh, look at that. Total of bonus 8 to fire. The bonus is gonna jump further once we have our level 4 magic blender. Alright. Okay, we're just gonna stand by for a bit. Okay, um. Do a bit of fortune telling. Okay, um. You know what? I'm done with this quest. <laughs> I spent too much time farming here. I'm not gonna do anymore. I'm pretty much guaranteed to get pretty bad level tablets at this point from over farming and over leveling. So I'm just gonna defuse, unlock this like treasure chest and sharp eye here. You know, monsters. Tablet here. Nope. I'm just gonna ignore it. I'm just gonna complete this and go straight to the boss. I don't care anymore. Back to the constellation. 
Nope, you're not gonna attack me. So I just gotta complete this. Alright, it's a trident. Or a fork. Whichever you lingo you prefer. I prefer a trident, it sounds cooler. But yes, we'll just jump in and let's see what we have prepared for us. Whoa, what's that? More meteors? Dimensional gap constellation asylum? This is both heaven and earth. And whoa! Wow, it's pretty mean looking guy, huh? Set foot in my temple, defends the heavenly aurora. Heavenly, you don't know. Oh!